Uh, congratulations for another excellent year of uh, of school. You finished school for the year, or have you got another? What, what's happening today? Have you if, on Wednesday? I'm leaving. Oh, Wednesday. Wednesday. What this next week? Oh, Wednesday. I'm actually going to my dad's. Oh, yeah. whereabouts does he live? In Marimbula. Cool. Okay. And uh, how are you getting to Marimbula? Flying by myself. Are you crazy? And you're seven. Yes. Have you done it before? Yes. Are you kidding me? You've fl- you've flown in an aeroplane. Was any? What, what, I don't. Was it? Did you like it, mate? You got to keep your head. Remember in the square. That's your last chance. Seriously, I'm going to pull your pants down. <laughs> I'm going to dack you. Not pull your pants down and smack him. Dack him. We like. We, we don't smack in here. We dack. Uh, well, that's exciting. Um, and what are you going to do up in Marimbula? Um, we're going to go to the Gold Coast. And go to Waterland. Waterland. I think it's called Water World or Sea World. I think it's called Water World. Water World. Have you ever been there before? No. Oh. Can you see yourself in that camera? Yes. Okay, good. But also we're going to go to the Gold Coast. Oh, cool. Uh, have you been to the Gold Coast before? Have you been to any of these places before? No. Oh, that is incredible. Are you excited to go to new places? Yeah, but have you ridden there? Have I ridden there? Been there. I've been to, yes, I have been in Waterworld and Sea World and Dreamworld. I used to live on the Gold Coast. Mm. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, don't ask me questions and then, like, don't follow, you didn't even follow up with another question. You just left me hanging. I'll just, I'm just. i going to give you one answers. Yes. What are you doing, uh, what are you doing for the rest of the school holidays? So you're flying out on Wednesday, but hang on, hang on, hang on. How old are you? Seven. <laughs> You're uh, are you seven. You look like you're like a ten year old. <laughs> Do you feel seven? Do you feel like you're seven? Do you feel a bit older, younger? Do you? Older. Do you feel a bit older. Yeah, yeah. You definitely look a bit older. Um, but seven's cool. When was your birthday? Uh, you mean when is my birthday? When is your birthday? Do you know you have the same birthday date every year? It doesn't change. 28th of June. We get out and guess whose birthday is the day after yours? Yours. <laughs> yeah. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Come in closer. Come in closer. Uh, well, that's exciting. Uh, so now... But also my dad's birthday is on the same day as mine. That is so fun. So you can... If you ever get to hang out with your dad on your birthday, you both can just have the same, like a massive party, joint party. Because my dad's 29 now. 29. How old are you? Seven. Oh. It's 20. How, is how much older than you is he then? You know how to do your additions. How many more years is your dad if he's 22 and you're seven? How many numbers in between? Seven. Eight, ten, eleven, twelve, eight, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, twenty, twenty, fifteen. <laughs> you, do you agree? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and uh, and what do you like doing with your time? What's some of your favourite things you like to do? Like if you had a, if you just didn't have to go to school today, what do you reckon you'd do? Um. Oh, you gotta get up nice and high. See up there. Now we're talking. Yeah. Um. What do you like doing? If you had a full day of whatever you like to do, and you had to be outdoors, what would you like to do? Uh, probably play soccer. Do you like playing... Where, how long have you been playing soccer for? Um, maybe like two weeks. Yeah, okay. Maybe two months. Yeah, about two months. Yeah, it's nice. Probably about four years, but it's okay. Two months. So two months you've been playing soccer. And who's your favourite player? Um, the Messi or Cristiano Ronaldo and Pogba. Who's the third? I know, I know Lionel Messi. I know who that is. And I know... Um, Cristiano Ronaldo Who doesn't What was the last one? Pogba Who's that? Um, <laughs> who does he play for? I, I forgot what he plays for But what He's col- a good player Who's the better Who's the best out of all of them? Probably Leo Messi And then Cristiano Ronaldo And then Pogba Haha <laughs> cool Hey tell me about have you, How many holidays have you, You're about to go on a holiday Up to Marimbiol How many holidays have you been on Have you been on lots of holidays In your life? Because you're seven, like, you've been around forever. Yeah. Okay. Have you got a favourite one? No. Oh, okay. No favourites? Just all the same? What about the worst one? Do you remember a holiday other than the one you're about, uh, the other ones that you have with me? 
Uh, have you got a worst holiday that you didn't have a great time? You're like, oh man, this is the worst. I just wish I was back at school. No. Oh. What about um, when you win things at school? I, I, I like to, because I know that you're going to a new school today to check it out, but I'm going to talk about that in a minute. At your school now. Hey, can you see up here? Yeah, look up there. Don't look at your microphone. It's boring. People are like, look, look at your beautiful eyes. Where do you get your lovely eyes from? Did you make them? No. Who made them? Dad. You, huh? From my dad. What's that? From your dad? Yes. Yeah, your dad's got beautiful eyes. Like you. <coughs> yeah. Who do you reckon's got the most beautiful eyes? Your mum. My mum's got brown eyes. Are they beautiful? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> keep your head up, keep your head up. Look, 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 look. Yeah, just look at yourself. Mate, they want to see your lovely smile. If you want, stare down there. Do you know Levi's watching? Say hello to Levi. Go. He's watching. He just sent me a message going, hi from... He said to me, look, he just said hi from... Look, hi, Lockie, from Levi. So what are you going to say back to him? See, in the chat? Hi, Lockie, from Levi. He's watching you right now. I know. Okay, that's cool. That's okay. So, what are you going to say back? What do you say when people say hello to you? Hello. <laughs> hey. So, so um, when you win things or when you tell, can you tell me what the dead a deadly ticket is or deadly or like what are those tickets? Um, therefore, if you be good at school, you get them, and, and the principal, um, you put you put half of your name in a jar. Okay. And the principal puts his head in the jar. Yeah, come okay. on. What are you doing? Well, who's, well, I'm over here, mate. What are you talking? you got to talk to me. Talk to me or the camera. And yeah. he picks out the jar. And if he... Say if the principal teacher put... 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 Put out my name. Oh, yeah. Um, That means that I got to go to the principal's office and then pick a prize. So you got to put your name in the jar to be a part of it. You got to go. I'm in. And then if you're good, and what like what do you mean? What do you mean by being good? Like what's being good? If you be good. You get that ticket. Like good what? Like 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 if you just like um like wash your hands or if you um eat all your lunch. Like what do you mean good? I don't know what being good is. What does that mean? What do you have to do? Have, what did you get? What did you get it for? Your last deadly ticket. Yum. What did you get it for? Can you remember? Being good at outside. Oh, okay. Like doing what? Like cleaning up stuff and... No, like picking up 10 pieces of rubbish on the floor. Oh, it's, a good, it's good to clean up, isn't it? Mm. 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 You don't seem to do that around this house though, do you? No. <laughs> <laughs> what about... So maybe... What if we got had deadly tickets around this house? Do you reckon it might inspire you to pick up the bath towel and put it back where it goes? Yes. Okay, okay, interesting. We're just having a little family meeting here, family discussion, uh, how we can progress in certain areas of, of cleaning up the house. But uh, that's really exciting. And so you've probably got lots of deadly tickets, hey? Yes. How many do you reckon you've had over the time? Ten. Oh, wow, that is so good. Well, good work. Um, can you sit up on the pillow a bit higher? You've slid down. Yes. Hey, uh, and then what are you, so what are you doing today? Um, I'm going to check out my new, my new school. Cool. And is it a school that Levi goes to? Yes. Do you know what it's called? Do you know the name of the school? No. Okay. And are you looking Are you looking forward to, to going to checking out a new school? Yes. Oh, cool. Um, I think it's really exciting. I changed schools at your... Oh, mate, we were talking about this last night, hey? I changed schools. What are you, why are you staring at your toes? Why aren't you looking at me? Do you want me to tickle you? I can tickle you. We've got about 15 more minutes. I can tickle you 15 minutes. No. Oh, come on. I thought I, I, I have so much fun when I'm tickling you. All right, so you're loving soccer. And, uh, hey, what would what would you like to be when you grow up? Uh, like, like, what's one of your... What's like... You AFL can't be a, player. Oh, <laughs> AFL. Here we go. You must love... Do you love sport? Mm, yes. How many sports do you reckon you like? Um, what sports do you love? So AFL, soccer. AFL, soccer. NRL. Oh yeah, NRL's pretty. Oh, that's because AFL and NRL are different, aren't they? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Are you gonna eat that booger? 
I'm just scratching my nose. Oh, okay. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Are you still hungry after breakfast? You want to eat your burgers? No. Okay. Um, okay, so that's really cool. Uh, you want to be an AFL player? Who would you like to play for? Yes! <laughs> I think parenting really is about making sure that your kids or anyone in your life make sure that they barrack for the same team. Otherwise, we're going to have some problems. Because what about it? Yeah, I mean, we're not even going to talk about barracking for another team. So we've converted. We've got the Geelong Army going wild. There's a lot of Geelong supporters. Levi, I'm going to... Uh, do you reckon Levi goes for Geelong? He lives in Geelong. Do you know his dad absolutely loves Geelong to almost like a um, like an illegal level? Like it's like he loves them to an illegal level. You can look up there. Like he goes wild. He goes mm. wild. And and don't worry about my mum's psycho. Um, mm. <laughs> yeah. And um, he loves the cats so much. But I reckon Levi. Hi, Lockie. Alex said. Alex, you know Alex. Um, Lockie, do you love Geelong? I mean, not Lo- Levi. Do you love Geelong? Heaps, because now Lockie loves Geelong, and that means you guys can watch. You might as well be able to go to a football match next to you when you move down to Geelong. Um, what's your favourite food? Oh, <gasps> what does it say? Can you read? What does yeah. it say? Yes. What does it say? Because I asked, I asked Levi, what do you? Who do you bake for? And what did he say? What did he say? Yes, Geelong. Yeah. Do you know the Geelong song? Not yet, not yet, that's a bit hard. Um, what did I just ask you? Favourite food, favourite food, favourite food. Favourite food, favourite food. You can come up here. <laughs> What's your favourite food? Like right now, if you were to... Um, what would you be favourite food for breakfast? Um, you can say anything, even if you don't get it any much. But what's your favourite food for breakfast? I don't know. I'll pick one. Porridge. Scrambled eggs. <laughs> yeah, you love scrambled eggs. I make them myself. Uh, how do you make them? What's your, what's your trick? What's your how, what's your method? I put I'm I put oil in the pan and yep. then I get a scoop of butter. Sit up, put mate. It, what are you doing, mate? I <laughs> put a scoop of butter in the pan. Yeah. Keep going. <laughs> scoop of butter in the pan. Keep going, mate. What are you doing? Why are you, are you trying to crawl away? Okay, 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 okay. I am tickling him. He's got the littlest tickly legs. Go, okay, yes, yeah, yeah. So you put um, oil in the pan. Butter. Butter. And then I wait until that heats up. Yep. And then I put, and then I get a bowl, crack the eggs in the bowl. Yep. And. And then I put, and then I put milk in, and then I mix it. Oh and yeah. then I put cheese in, and then I mix it. I get out. I think that's the and little. Then, yeah. And then I put, I put uh, into the pan, and then I just wait until it boils up. Okay, and you get it nice and soft and fluffy, don't you? I love your scrambled eggs. I think that's the trick. Is you put cheese in it. That is. Uh, uh, Cheese in scrambled eggs. How many people put cheese in scrambled eggs out there? That is a, a very, very good recipe. And I think a lot of people are going to go, oh, that's a new thing. I'm going to definitely change my scrambled eggs to the way Lockie makes his scrambled eggs. What about for dinner? What's your favourite dish? Tacos. Tacos. And uh, you do, you don't mind a little bit of Taco Tuesday, hey? Is it Taco Tuesday? Do you have tacos on Tuesday sometimes? Mm. Oh, yes. Maybe not. Yes. Uh, what are you looking down there for again? Yeah, mate. You, you're on your ninth warning. You basically get about 15 warnings, maybe 27 warnings. Depends, actually, whether or not we can be bothered doing anything about it. But you just do whatever you want, don't you? You just do whatever you want? No. <laughs> um, okay, so tacos. What are you having in your ta- tacos? Do you know what country tacos are from? No. Have a guess. If it's not from Australia, what country do you reckon it's from? Tacos. Think about. Think about. What Africa? about Africa? Not far away. Not far away. Can you think of um, any of the pictures on the taco shells boxes? Can you remember what any of the people are watch are look dressed like? Mm. Are they got hats on or anything like that? 
Have you heard of Mexico? Yeah. Okay. Well, tacos apparently from Mexico, but the Americans made it a little bit kind of, they made their own kind of version. Oh, Kate's there. I love, oh, Solomon. You all met, mate, Solomon's on here too. I love scrambled eggs too from Solomon. Um, okay, and what about um, what about any other foods? What about anything that I've cooked, Joe? Mm, interesting. Taco's Taco's got Taco's got top spot. I've been working very hard at this. But anyway, what uh, what else do you what else do you like eating that maybe I cook for you all the time? Mm. Say um, it. Porridge. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what I cook for you all the time? And that's your favourite food that I cook for you all the time. No. Okay, you've got 15 seconds to think again and not say porridge. What else do I cook you that you love? Um. Think about it. Think about it. Think about it. And I've taught you how to cook it. Spag bowl. Yeah! You can win <laughs> friends with spag bowl. You can win friends with spag bowl. And can you now? A lot of people on this line, on this chat, have actually seen me cook spag bowl because I done. Remember the first time we were hanging out in Ballarat, and we were, I was cooking in the video in the kitchen. Okay, and but then I taught you how to make it. So give us the ingredients. Can you remind me what I'm going to test you and see if you remember? And we Bacon. Had, bang. Um. Sit tomato. Up. Tomato. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? Ginger tomato. Sandra, it's, uh, hang on, hang on, oh, camera down, camera down, camera down, camera down. More on you, more on you, less on me. There you go. Now you're in. Now you can't hide. Uh, yeah, you go. Bacon, sun-dried tomatoes. Bacon, sun-dried tomatoes. Tomatoes. Actual tomatoes? Are they in a can or off the off the trees? A can. Can. Bang. Yep. Um. Uh, hmm. <laughs> meat? What kind of meat? <laughs> do you know what? Do you know what meat that is? No. Oh, it's um, it's possum. It's possum meat. It's possum. Possum. It's the the toenails of possum meat. So it's not really. Can you not? Don't tell anyone that you have possum meat. Toenails. We have uh, beef. It's beef. Uh, do you know what animal beef is? Okay. Why you got your head down again? Don't you like looking at the camera? Well, you got such pearly eyes. Like, just give it. Like, give the fans what they want. They want to see those eyes. Look how beautiful they are. Um. Okay. Hang on. We haven't finished our spag bowl recipe. Bacon, tomatoes, sun-dried tomatoes, meat. Um, it's hard. Spaghetti. Yeah. How, how do you say? It? You used to say peschetti, didn't you? You said it right then for the first time, I think, ever. This is this is an advancement. Peschetti? Yeah. What else? What and uh, um, what what do I like to have a little sip of every, every now and then at night time? Tomato sauce. I like to... S- <laughs> I like to sip on tomato sauce, do I? So when you go to bed and I just have a little sip and, and before... I over t- What? Wine. Yeah, you put that in there. I'm going to seriously make that. Uh, I'll give you tomato sauce in a minute. You trying to tell everyone that I drink tomato sauce? <laughs> you do. I remember when we were at Nana Bubs and he just got in. <laughs> <laughs> I did actually drink tomato sauce. I drank tomato sauce. I, you, you see, you have got a great memory. You pretend you can't remember things, but you can remember me the one time that I've ever done it with you. Did I just drink it out of the bottle? Yeah. <laughs> I did, I did, I did, I did. Um, oh, that's hilarious. All right. Um, what else do you want to talk about? Tell us about it. What are you scared of? Other than going to sleep at night? Animals? Planes? What What do you... What, what animal do you... Like, if you saw an animal go, like, right now, if Heights. I just went... Huh? I can't hear you, mate. Heights. Oof. But you don't mind aeroplanes? Or do you get scared when you go on the aeroplane? But you no. still... It's a bit different up in the air in aeroplane because you you are you can't you can't feel it. It feels like you're just kind of I don't know, just like floating in air. How high? What? How high are you scared of? Like if you stood on this table here, would you be scared? No. Okay. If you stood up uh, on that clothesline over there, would you be scared? 
No. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. We're going two meters. What about up the top of that back shed over there? Stood up on that. No. Oh, you're doing a lot better than probably most people. You're up to about three or four meters. What about on top of Nana Barb's house? No. Are you even scared of heights? How high are we talking? Give me something. Give me a height that you'd be scared of. Uh, the mountains. The mountains. Mountain height. <coughs> because me and mum were me and mum were um at Tasmania we were climbing um mountains. Oh yeah. Yeah. And and then we found this lake. Yeah. Tell me. Don't tell mum. Tell me. Tell me. Look at me. Found this lake. What are you falling down? Yeah, so you can't get out of it. Mate, yeah. Uh, yeah. Had this lake, yeah. And See that, mate? Describe the lake. Describe the mountains. I'm not there. you got to tell me. What's going on? People are listening. They're going, they're, was, in, they're in I trench. Was on, I was on Charlie's back, which, <gasps> do you know Charlie? I know Charlie. And I was on Charlie's back and he nearly slipped. While you were up the mountain? No, I was, we were climbing, but he saved himself. <laughs> oh, wow. Close call, close call. Hey, what did you do last weekend? And then we go oh. to the top of the mountain. Sorry, keep going. Yes, sorry. And then you went to the top of the mountain, yes. Okay, you're not adding anymore? No. Okay. You sure? It's because it's about two minutes up and you like to add things two minutes later. For the sound of it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you're a funny kid. Um, what do you like about being seven? Um, Better than six. What? Like, what's the difference? Um, what do you like being? What do you like? What do you like about being a kid? Running around. Yeah, are you a good runner? Yes. Hey, who, who are your friends? Who are you? Who are your friends at school? Can't, what? I can't hear you because the microphone's on. Luca. Luca. Anyone else? Uh, yeah, that's it. Okay, so you don't know a Felix or a Leo? Felix, Leo, Dexter, Reuben. Okay. Oh, now the floodgates open. Floodgates open. But Luca's Luca's probably your favourite. One you've hung out with the most. Who's the fastest out of you and Luca? Uh, Luca. Oh. He's the fastest in the class, and then I'm the second. Well, 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 what? Have you had a race, or you just know? I know. You just know. Can you, do you reckon he'd ever get faster than Luca? Uh-uh. Is he pretty fast? Why is he so fast? How does how does he get faster than you? I get faster, but he gets faster too. Okay, and then and then you get faster, and he gets faster, kind of thing. Okay. Do you think it's got to do with the shoes that you wear? No. Or what or what or what? Um, maybe what t-shirt you wear? No. Okay. What does it got to do with? I don't know. Oh. It's 8 o'clock. Oh, it's 8 o'clock. Well, what are you got to do? Nothing. Okay, no worries, thanks. Sorry, um, I forgot to tell everyone it's 8 o'clock. Um, and this is really good radio and this is Kids Week and Lockie Aldridge. Um, why, uh, Lockie Aldridge is our guest, our final guest for today. Mate, we're on air. Like, can you pretend that you're excited? Why do you yawn? Why do you always bring all your like lethargic moves when the camera's on? See, there's you right there. Everyone's watching. And hey, why do, why do I call you Lochi? Can you remember that? Can you remember why? Can't hear you, mate. Microphone's not to your mouth. Because we're on a meeting. Yeah. We were watching a radio show, weren't we? Another one in yeah. Toronto. Yeah, and, and... And that person called me Lochi. Because <laughs> I spelt your name. Because how do you spell... Look, it, can you, it was L-O-C-H-I-E. L-A-N. Yeah, that's for Lachlan, but I wrote I wrote Lockie like it's like it's the same up the top of the thing and said L O C H I E and these Americans went oh and shout out to Troy and Carissa and Lochi how you doing Lochi <laughs> and that's not even how you say your name but they didn't know because they're Americans and they say things differently than us but it does look like a little bit like Lochi but I think Australians might go mm, that's probably not a word I reckon it's Lockie. What's your middle name? Uh, Aldridge. Right. So your name's Lockie Aldridge Aldridge. I mean, Aaron. <laughs> Aaron. Hey, someone just said, good luck at your new school today, Lockie. That's from a friend, Shelley. What do you say to her? 
I don't know. Okay, that's good. And what about um, oh, Kate? Can, Kate loves a bit of scrambled egg. Clear the floor for Lockie. People are really excited. This is great. Uh, okay, well, so before you head off, what would you like to say? To the, what, what have you liked? All the other guests that you've, have you seen? All the other guests that came on. You, did you see Solomon? Yes. Okay, Solomon. Who else? Juliet. Remember Juliet? Yes. The singer. Who else did we have? I'm trying to remember. I'm trying to remember. I'm trying to remember. Oscar. Oscar came on yesterday, and Wilhelmina. Did you watch them all? No, I didn't watch. Okay, but you just—you still knew that was on. How did you know Oscar was on? Because I heard you were in the car. I oh the yeah. Well, we watched the replay. How how good is he? Can you? Oh, you love doing those tricks. Can you do those tricks with the water bottle? But I know someone in DB trick shot. In what? I know someone in DB trick shot. In what? I can't hear. I know someone in DB trick shot. In who can do a trick shot? I, I know. know a name. So I know someone. <gasps> oh, who? I know his name too. What? Ty. What, is he a friend of yours? No, he's just going to... Is he famous? <laughs> no, he He's got a moustache and a beard. <laughs> like mine? Or different? No. <laughs> More black. <laughs> Righty, eh? Um, what do you mean? Like, <laughs> more black than my beard. Wow. Kids say the darndest things, don't they? Well, Lockie, uh, I want to know if I want to talk about anything else because you're the last guest that I've got for Kids Week, but we can get you on another time. Um, hey, what do you think? What do you feel when you hear? Oh, you can't hear. You can't hear. You can't hear. Ty from Dude Perfect. Oh, it's from Dude Perfect. <laughs> oh, okay. While well, you're sliding down, sit back up again. That's right. Number nine. This is what all day long. All day long, this happens. That's it. Okay. Come here. Move the chair out of the way. Move the chair out of the way. Stand, stand up. Move the chair out of the way. Stand up. Move. Stand up. Stand up. Jump off. Jump off. Jump off. Jump off. I'm going to move the chair out of the way. <laughs> Jump off for a second. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. This is what's happening. This is what's happening. Yeah. Excellent. I'm going to hold you. I'm going to hold you like I hold my whippet. Okay. And, okay, and you've got to put the microphone to your mouth. Okay. And so, uh, what are you going to do for your school holidays? <laughs> um, get to the Gold Coast. Okay. Well, Lockie, thank you so much for being um, kid, the final kid. What are you wiggling around for? Thank you so much You're for being... You're me! What? You're tickling me. No, I'm not. You're wiggling around. Can you stop wiggling around? This is a radio show and we take this very seriously and it's Kids Week. This is Kids Week and Lockie, stay, come here. Okay. Now, can you say thanks everyone uh, for listening to Kids Week this week? Uh. Lockie, we're live. We're live. Say, you got to say thanks, thanks, to, can you say thanks to all the kids for coming on this week? Okay. Now you got to speak in my phone. Thank you. <laughs> there you go.